a master of life. When I was 18 years old, I met someone who was a master of life. He taught me how to see, how to live, and how to be. He taught me things I'm still unpacking today, things I'm profoundly grateful for. He gave me a manual for my own mind. He showed me how to sit down and disappear, how to dissolve my mind into the seas of boundless, formless bliss that flow just beyond the realms of form. On the other side of this world of here and there, there's a field of endless, boundless, perfect bliss. When this bliss is experienced, it washes the structure of the self clean of the heaviness of being. All of your doubts, all of your heaviness, all of your pain, all the accumulated cruft of a lifetime of limitation, it's all erased in an instant, blown away by the sheer force of the blissful brightness that rolls through your being and literally overwhelms you. The heaviness of you, the part that has become chronically contracted into what you associate as the shape and inner boundaries of your limitations in thought and feeling, is undone. The experience is a little like feeling a muscle you never knew you had right in the middle of your mind suddenly relax for the first time, right before feeling the knot you carry in your heart do the same. It makes everything okay. Its experience informs in no uncertain terms that everything is perfect, that the nature of all of this is boundless perfection, that everything is going to be all right. Learn to meditate, make friends with yourself. Inside your mind are worlds of pure bliss waiting for you to discover them, but you have to look.